Hey guys, so I just filmed this colorful summer, spring, summer makeup look going on here and it was kind of like a chit chat and I know you guys probably wanted to see some colors so I said let me just incorporate some color in this going on today girl instead of neutral stuff. Um, don't get me wrong, I love my neutrals. Doing colors is kind of like a something big for me because I usually don't do colors girl I stick with my neutrals and call it a day my lips look red but you will see that they are not red it's just it's my lighting that's going on right now but anyway um I wanted to say in the video my camera had like a bad habit of cutting off and whatever so a part of this eye look I didn't get on camera I was sitting there talking and, and doing it and I, I didn't even know I was not filming so I explained that in the video but I did tell you how I got the deep part of my eye look but that was just it a tutorial is still a tutorial so I hope that you guys enjoy it and if you want more summer creative looks like this then thumbs up this video and um thanks for watching I'm Drug So Queen Nini and I'll talk to you guys later bye y'all okay so these are the two palettes I'm going to be coming from which is my BH Cosmetics palette and then my eyes on the 60s palette I'm just going to take this yellow from my BH Cosmetics and put it on a brush like such I'm just taking it. So now all I'm going to do is just simply place this color on my lid like so. So basically all I'm doing is tapping it right on my lid and kind of, you know, pressing it in a little bit. I'm just tapping it and moving it around all fast. Uh, and that's all I What do you ladies think about um, Housewives of Atlanta reunion? Uh... Uh, needless to say, I like the reunion. However, I'm kind of over Housewives of Atlanta. It seems like the girls kind of grew more so apart than they did together, especially this season. And for all you guys who are Team Kenya, you might want to exit this video because I don't even like her. Like, I can't stand Kenya. If you guys may know, and it may not be a shock, but my favorite girls on the show is, of course, Candy and Phaedra. Those are my girls. Nene, I like Nene. Nene. I like Nene sometimes, but not all the time because she can start some stuff. And, uh, uh, uh But Nene reminds me, her whole attitude and, I don't know, she reminds me a lot of my mom. And my mom likes that people think of her when they see Nene. I'm like, why you like that? But... <laughs> I think my mom sees a lot of her and Nene too. Like them, they gotta be related. So now I'm gonna go into my BH Cosmetics um, 120 eyeshadow palette, and I'm gonna be switching brushes when I apply this color. But I'm gonna go into like this darkest, the darkest orange here, and I'm gonna just kind of put that into my crease and go from there. As I was saying, there's a reason why I don't like Nene though, um, and it's simply because. Nene is one of them people who can dish it out, but she cannot take it whatsoever. Like, she will dish everybody, and I mean, and she will tell you, like, what's wrong with you and how it is and how you, you know, not a good friend, but you could tell Nene her faults and she ain't got shit to say to you, you know what I'm saying? And I don't like people like that. If you want, if you want to tell somebody off, then... You need to be able to accept it when they decide to tell your ass off too. And she's not one of them people who can do that. So it's it's kind of like, mm, now yeah. I'm going to take this pink, it's like a hot pink for my BH Cosmetics palette. And I'm just going to kind of like blend this into the orange as such, just to like darken it up. Just like this. But yeah, also it was like sad to see the, fr well not even sad to see the friendship of, what's that girl name? Um, what's them two? Cynthia and Nene because I knew it was going to happen sooner or later. Usually friendships like that, they don't last for too long. And ugh, Cynthia was always one. I mean, it was, they were right. Like she always was like going, uh, you know, it was trying to like always trying to please Nene. And I can say Cynthia is kind of like a good person. But then again, Cynthia got her faults too. Like... I don't know. So, Cynthia, you ain't gonna talk to my husband like that. Nene or not, I don't give a shit who you is. You can call my, you can tell my husband stop acting like a bitch. I'm gonna have to, you know, say something to you. So, I, I didn't like that so whole basically, statement. basically, my whole eye look was not recorded. After I went in with the, with the pink and the orange, I, um, took 
a dark dark purple and mix it with a dark green and I just basically put that in the outer V of my eyes and all I'm doing now is I'm about to blend these colors in. I deeply deeply apologize that it did not. <laughs> I'm sitting here talking telling y'all how I feel and I'm not even recording and it's sad. What I'm doing now basically is blending this these colors into the pink so that there's not like a major difference and I'm just getting it like smoking it out some and kind of just blending it. As you can tell this eye is blended and this eye looks a hot mess. So you see what I'm doing like these two colors are transitioning and this one I didn't blend yet. That's then I was talking about Mimi and um, what's that guy name? Mimi and uh, I can't think of his name but there was no way them tapes were leaked. Your husband, your, your husband, your boyfriend Nico released those tapes on his own. And he sent those tapes to the company and wanted some bread off that. And you can be stupid if you want to and feel like, oh, I don't know how it got leaked. Only two people had, only y'all only had the tapes. So, it, it, it's just crazy how TV, if you guys have not seen Tyrese's, um... What he had to say on it, because he do like mini vlogs and, and, and just like say what he got to feel about stuff that's going on in the industry. And he was just saying how the industry, you know, not the industry, reality TV is turning people into, you know, something that you're not. And, it, and it's just changing the way a relationship is really supposed to be and how... And, how it's really supposed to function and we are so influenced by what we see on TV that our relationships don't last and he spoke on a I mean it was a really really great point that he was bringing up and it's just sad like Mimi I don't know I'm sorry if I got a daughter and I know years from I, I, I just have a daughter I have a kid and I'm putting on a sex tape please I don't mind filming in our room and that's just for us to watch and whatever we keep but to make money off this and for the world to see that's poor judgment right there baby I don't give I don't care what my boo gotta say boo we gonna make all this money you couldn't pay me and it's crap I me mean, money just controls us and we're so in we're so enslaved into it like uh, it's, it's all about the money and it's sad it's so well, scrappy sad. met up with that girl Erka Erka P Erka Pinky and as I told you love and hip hop is scripted and I think this was a part of the script I hate females because this girl knew that he was in a relationship with Bambi yet she was touching on his arm and you know she was flirting with him oh no. okay so we're not done with the eyes we're gonna go in and draw in our little wing first um because if yeah. you all know i really don't do dramatic wings i just do something nice and simple simply because if you mess up a wing girl you messing up your whole damn eye look and i ain't got the time to experiment and stuff like that so i just go for something simple I have my favorite lashes so far, which is the Cara lashes, and they look like, well, they come in a package like this, but they look like the ones I have on. These are number 213. I got these from iKateHouse.com, um, and these are my favorite lashes. Like, I kind of forget that I have these on, and they're kind of like natural looking, like, I love it. So, now we're going to finish up the eyes, and I'm going to go in with this um, NYX. Uh, auto eyeliner and this is in the color white and I'm kind of just gonna open my eyes a little bit more so oh, as you can see my yeah. eyes look way bigger and I look like a little baby doll going on right <laughs> so all I'm gonna do is take the yellow that I have in my lid color I'm just gonna put that into my inner tear duct and then that'll be it for the eyes okay so those are my eyes now we're gonna get right to the lips and now I can either make or break this lip <laughs> this look and first I'm gonna outline my lips in brown as you and know. voila now I'm gonna go in with like this lip liner brush and I'm going in with this dark purple by NYX it's called Medusa you guys guys have seen this before and what I'm gonna do is go over top of that perp that liner with this purple
Now what I'm going to do is take this lip sample that I have here. I featured, featured this in my lipstick lookbook. And I'm just going to fill that in. And then to fully, fully, fully complete this look, I'm going to go in with some concealer, and this is Cool Tan, and I'm just going to put that in the middle of my lips just to lighten it up some. 